Stop 12 on the Virginia Proud Weather Tour has taken us to Giles County. We're live here at the Giles County Rescue Squad. We came on a day where you guys are actually doing real training. Joining me right now is the training sergeant for Giles County. This is Chris Thornton. Uh, Chris, what are you guys doing right now? So we're just doing some yearly checkoffs that we do for all the members, uh, keep their skills up to date. We do different scenarios, trauma, medical, uh, we'll set up different stuff like you saw earlier, you know, bringing people out of cars, just doing some random, you know, like have them sitting in a chair, set up a thing, they're at home and they have a problem or they're in a restaurant, you know, and they have a kind of medical issue, something like that. The training that you folks do here at the EMS in Giles County, how long does that training take from beginning to end in order to be a qualified EMS uh, person? So the initial training, once somebody starts, they have to join the state mm -hmm. EMT class, which is a four to six month class. Mm -hmm. And once that's done, they'll get uh, precepted on different calls with different field training officers that we have here at the mm -hmm. squad. Um, once that's done, they'll get with me and the captain, Bill Davis, mm -hmm. and we'll sit down, do kind of this scenario with them, mm -hmm. get with them, make sure they know their skills, they're hitting all the points they need to hit. Mm -hmm then they'll be released to start running calls. Well, thank you very much for your time, thank and thank you. you for allowing us to be a part oh, of this training. Reporting live here in Parisburg, I'm Storm Team 10 meteorologist Jeff Hanowich. Back to you, John and Lindsay.